Um, the community has been more than welcoming um, and everyone's been so kind and uh, just wanted to help in any way they could. Um, and then the team has been awesome. They've really taken to me. Um, definitely, um, it's never easy to come in mid-season, especially when you had a great coach like Tyler um, that was there before me. But um, the players are doing doing really well, um, listening to what I say and uh, really buying into what we're trying to do. I would say we're going to have a really, really strong season. Um, the women are um, particularly strong. Uh, that we have basically a brand new one and two and three potentially um, all you know making a huge impact on the lineup um, and then the men are also very very strong as well um, the level has been really high in practice the energy has been really well so we're excited to get out and play some conference teams for sure so far um, we're only on the women's side we're only a couple days into practice really but um, Caroline Sproul is looking really, really strong out there. Um, and then Ashley Isaac, you know, coming in um, as a graduate student and playing one has been, has made a huge impact. Um, she is a very strong doubles player as well, loves being up at the net, uh, very aggressive, knows how the game works. Um, and then even last night um, at practice, I was just really impressed by um, pretty much everybody as far as their uh, they're really hungry out there to get better at doubles. They're really engaged in what I'm saying, trying to get them more aggressive because doubles is totally different than singles. So um, trying to teach them the kind of the strategies and uh, getting them more aggressive has been fun. It's hard to, you know, kind of pick any certain players, but, um, you know, Braden is looking really strong. John DeVito, um, captain for us, um, always comes out, puts really great effort in, great energy, and he... Uh, you know, he put in a lot of work in the offseason as well. Um, been very happy with a couple of our freshmen, Ethan Libby and Mark Trinka. They push each other in practice, so I'm really excited to see how they compete um, in matches. Um, and then Joe Patton, a guy who, you know, has been here a while, coming out just a veteran, really showing the team how to, how to compete, um, and, and, I, and I think leading in a really, really strong way for us. Yeah, um, it's kind of a unique situation where we're playing these really fun, exciting matches to start the season. A lot of times, um, you know, you ease your way into this, but we've got three really awesome opportunities um, down in, or in Orlando. So um, what I'm looking for us is to have um, solid expectations and not expect us to play our best tennis um, right out of the gate it's we have to build into a season um so i've been talking to the teams a lot about hey let's work our way up um you know you're not going to be playing your best tennis right away um and and just build into uh kind of those matches and i think that will ultimately help us to play our best tennis because the expectations won't be so high it takes it's it's hard for college kids sometimes to realize you know every time they step on the court they're not going to play their best tennis um, but managing those expectations is a huge part. Um, you know, Andre Agassi is famous for saying 10% uh, of the time you play your best tennis, 10% of the time you play your worst tennis, and 80% of the time you're somewhere in the middle, and it's about how you manage that 80%. Um, so I think the, you know, I've been talking to the team a lot about that 80% and how, how we manage that. No, I mean, obviously just really excited to be here. I'm in my, I guess, my second month now. Um, so I just want to say thank you again to, you know, the Wittenberg community for giving me such a warm welcome to my teams for um, really buying into what I'm trying to do here, uh, what we're trying to do here. Um, and just the administration has been uh, more than supportive with anything I need or anything we're looking to do. So just thank you all so much for that.